Hey, it's Jessica, and I'm here with my cage tour of the butterflies and caterpillar set that I got from Peavy's Piggy Palace. And I have salad. Salad for them. It's just lettuce and tomato. As you can see, there's Chloe. So let's go on there. And one over there. Back up so you can see everything. We'll start over here. And there is a corner curtain in the caterpillar, and underneath that is a one by one pad in the caterpillar. And then their first hay box and their hay bag, which I this is like my favorite print ever. It's so cute. It's the uh, bumblebees. Adorable. And we have the sneaky sack in the uh, same print as the liner, the butterfly. I have two of these sacks though. The other one is in the caterpillar. So after a couple of days, I'll take this one out and put the other one in. Everything's been washed twice. I wanted to wash the liners three times, but I thought I was cleaning the cage tomorrow, so that would have gave me today to do another wash. But I had to clean it today, so I forgot. And I was like, oh no, it's not going to wick, so I don't know how good it's going to wick. It doesn't feel that bad, but I don't know. Then I have these shoot pads, which you can't really see here for water bottle pads. Then in the back is the uh, Heidi Hut and the Cavi sa sh sh Shack. Can't speak words. Trying to not be shaky, but everything is shaky. There. Shack and Heidi Hut. Shack is in the butterfly print because I wanted it to be in the butterfly print just because I like Shacks a lot. Heidi Hut's in the caterpillar. Shoot is in the caterpillar, of course. Another water bottle, another drip pad. Let's see, there's, there's Chloe. Still just eating lettuce and nothing else, eh, Chloe? And in this corner, we have another caterpillar curtain and one by one pad, just so. I like to put, I always have pads underneath my curtains just so, you know, if they pee a lot, it will uh, at least get soaked up by this first before my liner. And another hay bag. It's the cute bee print. There's a close up cute bee print. That is my cage. I still have I'm trying to open up the tripod that it like kind of close it. So you're gonna get really shaky. Oh there. Now we'll just do this. There's Chloe being a cutie. But yeah, she's definitely just into lettuce. I didn't know. I didn't think she'd eat tomato. That seemed like a far-fetched vegetable for her to be trying right away. But I'm hoping she tries bell pepper. I'm surprised she didn't try the carrots, but she didn't try the carrots either. But I had them last night, I think. Must have been last night. I've only had her for like two days. So I don't know why it's such a, a question. Only thing left is tomato. Oh, she's eating tomato. Oh, I moved and showed to see. But she was trying to pick up that piece of tomato in that bowl. Maybe she didn't like the taste of it. Usually tomato is Trixie's favorite, so I don't know why she's not eating the tomato. Yeah, the sack is huge compared to you, Chloe. Huge. Yeah, you steal the lettuce. <laughs> Stealing leftover lettuce. Yeah, I don't know how long it's going to take her to want to eat more stuff than other than lettuce. I tried to give them the Hamaro treats. The uh, I only have one ball one left. I don't know if you can see it. 
I got that from Carrie and I try to give one to each of them and I put one beside Chloe. I knew she wouldn't take it from me. And I uh, thought she was going to eat it and then she walked away from it. Yeah, I'm using a tomato. You gotta eat tomato. <laughs> I don't know why she's going after uh, what Abby's eating. It's tomato. Ooh, camera got blurry. Weird. She doesn't know what to do with herself. Go eat tomato. She has been eating pellets. I don't know how much. But yeah, see, she goes for the tomato and she says, no, nah, I don't like it. And girls were teacher. It is good. So other than that, as you can see, they're all getting along. I know, I bet you some people didn't believe me when I said they were, until I showed the video. Yes, last night, or today if you saw it, the long one, of them just eating and whatever. So here is my cage. <laughs> She's kissing Trixie's mouse there. You kissing Trixie? There is my cage. I really like the butterfly print. And the caterpillar, I like both. But the butterfly print's really nice. I like the teal. I still have my Christmas garland up because that was a present from Maddie and I like it. And they haven't touched it, so whatever. It's just decoration. And the bedding that I have in my boxes are just the um, Arm and Hammer, like knockoff Carefresh. It works. So, yeah, that is like, I don't know, bug theme cage. I'm not really quite sure since I got the bumblebee bags, caterpillars, and butterflies. I think tomato was a bad thing to give them on the first day of being having a clean cage. Because, of course, they have seeds everywhere on the place. So that's great. And Daisy is making a giant mess all over her fur. <laughs> and there's Chloe. And back to hay, of course. All they care about is their hay. When I clean a cage, all they care about is me filling up their new hay bags and putting them in. So yeah, if you have any questions, go ahead and ask. Um, I will put a link again to PB's Piggy Palace if you're interested in her stuff. And thanks for watching. Bye bye.